welcome back. I got Omar here helping me. So this car is uh, good to go. So I ended up sending the computer out too fast to get checked and the computer checked out fine. So after marking everything off my little checklist, the only thing I had left was the idle air control valve. So I ordered a fast idle air control valve. I didn't want to make any mistakes to get one from like O'Reilly's or AutoZone. Put it on the car and uh, I'll show you. And ended up being a little sensor, but I did fix several issues like, you know, the um, boost leaks and the battery cable. So let's see. difference right I mean it sounds way better now we're gonna go get some fuel and I figured bring you guys along maybe scare him a little bit <laughs> idling really rich so I'm not sure if that's why it sounds a little funny but we hope it's fixed My bad Omar that was my bad I totally forgot to update the tune file um, I had been messing with it for the last couple of months trying to figure out these issues and well I owe you a ride along buddy mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and just you know put the car all back together you know bolt the panel back up pull the computer uh, get some fuel and uh, go test it around by myself so I don't end up wasting his time and I don't think I'm wasting his time. I'm pretty sure this car is fun to be in. What do you think, bro? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I'll make sure that the car is 100%. And then we'll see how much, how much we can scare Omar here. No? We'll see. All right, like I said, this car is fixed. So just finishing up a few things. Got baby over here helping me out. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> Car's good to go, so I figured take it out for a spin. Show you guys that it is fixed finally. How long did it take? 30 years. <laughs> How old are you? <laughs> it's been 63 years. <laughs> <laughs> or what, what did she say? Something like that. Something like that. Um, but, anyways. No, yeah. but it did take you a while. But the car is good to go. So let's go take it out for a spin. Oh man, feels really good to drive this car again. Considering that uh, the Supra is down, you know, this is my next uh, powerful car. So I'm glad that, that I'm glad that it's fixed. And uh, so far it's cruising really well. Right now I just, I hit it just a little bit and it went straight to red line right away. So I'm gonna show you guys here in just a second, but it's driving very, very good. All right guys, so I don't have a, uh, a head mount. So you're not gonna be able to see like the, the speedometer and stuff. So I'm gonna try and record myself. <laughs> see how this goes. Now the car isn't on a high boost setting, nothing like that. It's, it's on about mid boost. Just testing the car out. There's no point of me turning the car up too much. Give this a shot. She is safe back in the garage. Some people, I don't know, they're trying to get my plates or what was going on, but they didn't look too happy about me doing what I just did. But the car's fixed, so I owe my nephew Omar a ride along. So the next time that you guys see this car in a video, it's gonna be a ride along, so like a reaction video. Um, but you know, I was just actually reviewing the footage right now that I just recorded, which is what you guys just saw, and. Uh, I'll be I'm I'm gonna tell y'all something a little bit more personal about myself um, seeing that footage and just seeing how I look uh, man that really does get to me you know cuz I've always been you know for like the last 10 years I've always been kind of like trying to eating you know trying to eat healthy working out I mean I've always been on the side of being more overweight but I've always had muscle on me and the last year i've been really really slacking and uh i mean i feel weak um like it's not that i look weak i feel weak it's really bothering me and just seeing how i look on camera um compared to how i used to look it, it's uh you know i try to help people i try to help people as much as i can motivate them give them advice but um you know, one thing I've, I've learned is I can't help anyone if I can't help myself. So it's, uh, I think it's time. It's time for me to get back to one of the things that has helped me so much in my life to feel more confident, to feel better about myself. Not for anybody else, but just for myself. Like, you know, my wife, she tells me, I love you the way you are. And, you know, and she's a beautiful person for, for doing that. But you need to be able to love yourself. So it's time for me to get back into it. And uh, yeah, it's time to take the dust off all these weights and um, time for me to take care of myself. So I'm gonna do my best to keep up with the YouTube videos. I know I, w I really, really wanna do two videos a week, but let's be real you guys 
I, I'm not like a, you know, I'm not like a full-time YouTuber. That's not what I do. I work full-time, Monday through Friday. I'm a father. You know, I'm trying to manage this whole YouTube, Instagram stuff. I have neglected myself while doing all of that stuff. So, um, I promise, I know for sure at least I can get one video a week. Guaranteed, that's not a problem. Um, but I need to start taking care of myself because uh, the, the state of mind that I'm at right now, um, it's not the best. It's just me personally. And I think if I kind of take care of myself a little bit more, I'll feel better. Um, the, that's just the way I personally feel. Whenever I start to work out and I start to kind of, you know, like, myself a little bit more i'm i am in mentally a better place uh so that's what i'm gonna start doing um till then catch you on the next video later